Hey everyone! So today I wanted to film a little ColourPop haul video because two of my packages came in. I ordered the I Love Sarahi collection when it first came out and I also ordered about a week later the birthday unicorn bundle thing that ColourPop had going on. So the first thing we're going to get into is the unicorn bundle. So obviously it comes with this little note that says you make our heart skip a beat, which is super cute. And then it comes with a little book explaining explaining all of their products and things like that. Good ways to wear them and comes in every package. So it's wrapped up super nice. Oh I lied. This is the I Love Sarahi collection. So let's do that first. So each package came with the Super Shock Shadow, I believe in, yeah, in birthday. So it looks like that. I do have two. One came with each. I'm probably just going to give the other one to one of my friends. So it looks like that. Super pretty. This is the first Super Shock Shadow I have. I have a lot of their shadows. So it looks like that really nice. I like it. So I'm super excited to try that out. I've always wanted to try one of their Super Shock Shadows. Alright, so this collection came with two palettes and three, I believe, yeah, so three lip glosses or lip stains. So we have the Ultra Satin Lip, the Ultra Glossy Lip, and the Ultra Matte Lip. And it also came with three Libby pencils and then I love this packaging that was one of the things that drew me to it and just the colors I really love all the colors this is what these two palettes look like okay so we'll get into the lip glosses and such first. So the first one is the Ultra Matte Lip and it is called Mamacita and it is super dark. So it looks like that. I will do all the swatches after I show all the lippy pencils and everything. So the next one is the Satin Lip and it is, oh I guess this one doesn't have a name, it's just called 951. <laughs> Okay, so that one looks like that. And of course the packaging says I Love Sarahi by ColourPop. I really, really, really love this packaging. And the last lip is the Ultra Glossy, which is the one I'm most excited about. And this one is called Curvy. I just, I love that color. And now the Lippy Pencils. So the first one is 951, that's the color on the end, and that's what it looks like. The second one is Kirby, looks like that. I don't think I have right now any, no I think I do have like pencils. Lippy to goes, so I have these. I don't actually have just straight lippy pencils, and I've heard that the quality of them is very, very good. So I'm excited to try them. And of course, the last one is Mama Sita, and it is this beautiful color right here. Here are the swatches. So in order, we have Curvy 951, and then Mama Sita. Mama Sita is really dark. It's it's like a dark berry. It's gorgeous. It's a gorgeous color, but I'm more drawn to these like nude and pinky nude colors. And I really, really I am in love with Kirby. I think it's so pretty. But that's all three of them. They're beautiful colors. So now onto the thing that drew me to wanting to buy these so bad. 
the palettes. So the first palette is the Saucy palette. These colors are gorgeous, and this color, I feel like it's not picking up on camera properly, but it is so pretty. So, in order we have Heavy Glam, Chick Happens, Lit, and Razzie. And these colors are so beautiful. I will definitely swatch all of these. Um, after I show the other palette. So I'm definitely super excited. I think this one is, I definitely think I like this one better than the other one, but both of them, I, I couldn't pass up having this whole collection. There was no way I could only get one or two things. And then this one is Chicky or Chi Cheeky. I, I'm, I'm horrible at pronunciation, but I really like these colors as well. Like there's mattes, Mostly mattes, which I like, because these are perfect for, like, crease shades or blending. I really like these. And then the thing that drew me to it was Vivacious, which is this metallic right here. Gorgeous color. So both of these palettes are just beautiful. I don't know if this is still available. I know that right after I got it, it did go out of stock. But I would definitely, definitely recommend picking up this collection. So again, this is the Shiki or Chicky, I'm sorry, I'm not really sure how to say it, palette. All of these colors are absolutely gorgeous. I really, really like this dark brown. It's super buttery. A little bit of fallout, but nothing that would draw me away from wanting to get ColourPop shadows. Colourpop shadows are my favorite, and I definitely recommend purchasing things from Colourpop. Um, they have super cheap, like, pressed shadows. They're, I think, $5 or $6, and they're all gorgeous. This is the Saucy palette, and it swatches. I am noticing that the darker colors, such as Razzie and the dark brown in the other palette, they do have a little bit more fallout than the others. But these colors are so pretty. And I know, I know this is name dropping, but I know Jeffree Star just did a video um, with a look from the Saucy palette that I definitely, definitely want to try to recreate because it was so gorgeous. So I'm hoping that works out well because I absolutely, absolutely love the colors in this palette and I definitely don't have colors like this. Like, that is lit lit is gorgeous and then this heavy glam I definitely don't have a color like that it is so pretty so now that I am done ranting and raving about that collection and I don't think I will ever stop truly uh, I'm gonna get into the next box that I got stuff from so the first thing I got was this collection it's the Amanda Steele and Colourpop Weekend Warrior palette. Now, the reason that I got this palette, I do love all the colors. So, the colors are Throttle, Harley, Burnout, and Chopper. The reason I got it was because of this color right here. This is so beautiful. I mean, all of these colors are gorgeous. I don't have, like, a gray like this. And Colourpop shadows just they. They're so damn buttery, they just go on so smoothly, they blend out so nicely, and they're so inexpensive. So that's all of them right there. Like, these colors are so gorgeous. So, yeah, that green, had to get it. Don't have anything like that right now. I am in love with green, so I had to get that. And of course, because I love, it also comes with, you know, another Super Shock Shadow in birthday, because happy birthday to us. 
I'm giving this one to my friend. Because I love Colourpop, I had to get this. So it's their little birthday bag. It comes sealed up. It also comes with a card that also says, you make our hearts beat. I like that this package is resealable. I don't know why. But, yeah. So, I don't remember what this comes with, but we're just going to pull some stuff out here. So, it comes with three, I think these are all ultra glossy. Yep. So, it comes with three ultra glossy lips. The shades are Wishes, RSVP, and Bash. I'll open those up in a second. Oh, that was the biggest fun thing. Oh, it comes with stickers. That's so cute. Oh, I love that. Oh, great. It comes with more things than I thought it did. Alright, so... It comes with a Super Shock Cheek, which I don't have. I think that was one of the things that drew me to this. Because I don't really have any of their like highlighters it's that's what they call them super shock cheeks but it's their highlighters so it's a little bit bigger well not a little bit it's a little bit yeah no it's a little bit bigger than their super shock shadows looks like this this is the color blow me out it's pearlized oh god it almost feels creamy, but it's not a cream. Oh, that's so pretty. I really like that. It's so weird, like, and you can, like, push it in, but it's not, when it goes on, it feels like a powder. But just touching it feels like a cream. That's so weird. Anyway, so that's that. I really like this packaging, this, like, baby blue that they did for their birthday stuff that's cute so it looks like it comes with four pressed shadows oh these are pretty so I know some of these are duochrome and these are all their like unicorn colors so this is rager pretty. Yeah, it's definitely. The next one is the big three, which is a white duochrome. It's definitely more green reflective. It's pretty. I've never... I don't have duochrome eyeshadow, so it's definitely something new for me. It's definitely something to get used to, but I'm not 100% on duochrome shadows, but these are pretty. This one is Party Favors. I mean, that almost knocked my camera down. So Party Favors definitely has like a yellow shift. I like them. They're pretty so far. I really like this purple. This purple one is more similar to um, the white one where it has the like green gist to it. And this one is called Cakewalk. It's a little bit more powdery as well. I do like these though. It's definitely something that I can try out. It's not something that I typically normally use, but I will definitely try them out. Alright, and the alright, and the last three things are the ultra glossy lips which is the reason that I bought these because I love their glossy lip formula. Their matte formula tends to be a little too drying for me. I do love their matte lip. I thought these were really pretty. So the first one is called Wishes and it is like a metallic pink. Well they're all metallic pink but this is a metallic dark pink. And then the second one is called RSVP. It's a little bit lighter. And the last one is called Bash. Okay, so in order we have 
Wishes, RSVP, and Vash. One just rolled off my desk trying to escape. I definitely think these two are two that I would wear over probably some of my matte lips that are super drying. I know my Tarte ones that I have are super drying and some of my little ColourPop ones. I think the only one that I could wear by itself because it's opaque enough is Bash. It's definitely metallic and nice. I like it. But these two definitely are not, personally to me, opaque enough to wear by themselves. I mean, maybe if I wasn't, if I was just like doing like a low makeup day, I could probably just pop these on. But I definitely think I would put these over top something else. But I do love these colors. They're beautiful. Again, I definitely, definitely recommend ColourPop. I have an entire drawer dedicated to their stuff. And now I have more. And I have this whole palette here with ColourPop makeup in it. Like, I absolutely love, love, love ColourPop. It's just so cheap and it's, it's not so cheap that it's bad it's really well made it's super pigmented i've never had an issue with anything that i've gotten from them i love all their stuff so highly highly recommended so that's everything thank you guys so much for watching please leave a comment down below if you liked some of the stuff that i showed you guys today i will definitely leave prices um and any information that i can find on the I Love Sarahi stuff and the unicorn like bundle. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day.